cat day two. I've got Laura carrying my tack. Hi, gorgeous. Did he try to eat it? Oh, Jack, you're hungry. You little hungry. Like a boy. Hello, baby. Do you want breakfast? Yeah. How are we feeling this morning? I would like some more sleep. We well, got up at, well. It's not even that early, is it? It's, so. not, it's not even that early. Um, yeah. I'm just a lazy thing. Oh, Jesus, they all want their breakfast. These ones haven't been fed yet. Mimi's eating. Where is she? There she is, somewhere in there. I'm gonna muck out. And then I will show you guys what we're having for breakfast. We don't know what we're having for breakfast, but it's catered. It is catered. Doing right. She's got her massage pad on. She just had breakfast about a half hour before breakfast for us. So that will finish right in time for me to go have breakfast. I'm gonna go drain out her hay neck because that's been soaking overnight and then replace the one that she had overnight. And we have breakfast half hour for breakfast and then we are on for cross country so hopefully we are feeling brave today brave enough to use the whip behind my leg and not get thrown out the saddle it'd be good it'd be nice um i am expecting a number of stops and potential runouts but it's all about the progress and as long as we finish on a better note than we start then i am pleased with her <laughs> she's been an absolute angel yeah, I can't believe she was so comfortable that she went and lied down overnight. A number of times I went into my um, reeling gap and I put the motion detector on just because she's away from home just to see what she was doing. And um, yeah, oh, I've just got a text that breakfast is available at half seven. So, but yeah, um, I don't want to leave. I don't like to leave her unattended with that in case she gets it caught anywhere. So anyway, I'll be having breakfast at eight. This is the reason that my back is actually crippled and I need to go to the physio and the osteopath again next week. <laughs> Damn it. Well, it's actually not that bad because it's been draining a little bit. I'm that embarrassing friend. Hello. Hello. Nice mucking out. No. Yeah, he's quite mucky. That's quite mucky, guys. Enjoy going up the muck heap. Yeah. Um. Part number two, boy, I have a bad back. I'm about to carry this water container to fill up the nearest new water bucket. Yum. There she is. <laughs> so I want what?
to now she's enjoying it good 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 keep going keep going good sit up sit up good zoe well done rhythm sit up well what she's but sit up well done well done <laughs> Yeah, and um, 
I didn't really film much because a lot of it had to do with toes and no one wants to see toes. <laughs> so. It is lunchtime and we have little picnicky things. This is Rosie, she's joined us today. <laughs> and tomorrow she's spectating. Okay, bye. <laughs> yeah, that one's got the world's longest leg. Yeah. <laughs> Doing a lot of trotting. Mm. I like stitch, but I've been walking. Yeah. <laughs> I don't trot for long. Didn't make it very far. What do you away from us? <laughs> Right elbow back. Right elbow back. 
we got Lizzie somewhere over there. Just finished our final lesson of camp. It's gone by so quick and um, she's really sweaty from flat work. So taking a little, a little leisurely stroll around um, the big derby arena, which is oh, insane, insane, it's gorgeous. I do think she's a bit of a mountain goat. I reckon she would climb up that bank. Where is it? I reckon she would, she would give it a go for sure. <laughs> but uh, yeah, no, we're not doing that. So yeah, really, really pleased with her. She was absolutely like mega cross country this morning. Absolutely exceeded all my expectations. Um, just improved so, so much. And um, our instructor was saying that eventing with her is definitely a realistic goal, which has made me happy because we've been re really working hard and getting her um, to be a bit more well-rounded and not, not just to dress as queen. Um, so yeah, we're gonna finish our little lap around the arena. I'm gonna go cool her down, uh, give her a bit of a wash off. She's quite sweaty. Um, and then she can chill, have her feet. I'm gonna go watch the other girls cross country. And then what we got. And then I'll probably plat her for the little friendly competition tomorrow, just because I like her to look pretty and pampered. And I, I find plaiting really therapeutic. <laughs> it's really quite a repetitive task that is quite um, calming for me, especially if she's not gonna move. Anyway, see you in a bit. pretty tired and we're kind of just desperate to shower and go to bed so um i won't film tonight's edition of eating or sleeping but i will 100 percent be checking if amir's eating or sleeping oh yeah really really good positive day and tomorrow we've got little dressage friendly competition and then little cross country course so hopefully amir's in the same mood as today for cross country um very bold and brave and she just had so much fun i had a really great day so yeah off to sleep and then tomorrow final day it's been really really fun and it's gone by really really fast oh yeah thank you for watching <laughs> <laughs> 